ladies and gentlemen welcome to this game show where we will be having people winning cash money and this is one of this is second round where people join in play a simple game and they get themselves to win some money so if you're there we will be playing a very simple kahoot game i will be sharing the code shortly so that you can join but if you're not able to join us on kahoot you can still be able to join us live here and answer just in the comments very simple questions you put the answers in the comments and you get to win i want to know who is there and who is ready to go i can see yes i can see Joki saying she is ready there is benjamin give us five minutes okay we will give you the five minutes and we also have dr uh lincoln say uh, they're ready so if you're ready and you want to win some cash money playing kahoot let me know in the chat and let me know that you are ready oh okay good doing a quick roll call here yeah they are coming in i can see that person is uh silas is ready who else is ready people are ready people are ready let's get started with this game so that is the code i want you to go to kahoot.it and put in the code and if um not that let me copy the let me copy the and put it in the chat so that you can be able to join here's the thing only 10 people will be able to join us on the kahoot but the rest of us if you're on linkedin if you are on youtube you are on um where else are we linkedin youtube facebook i have put the link in the comment join in the game we might only have access to uh, only five people joining us in the game so okay i need to mute this one to avoid the right back okay there we go good 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 hey people are ready are you ready join the kahoot i'll put the link in the chat i want to see people joining and these are very simple game chaos saying they are ready i'll put in already the link in the chat join in the kahoot if you're not able to join you will be able to answer the questions here just by putting in the comments as we have people are joining in i want to give you the simple rules that we have number one it's uh, today we are going to play only one game and it's going to be 15 questions 50 general knowledge questions very simple for you to answer and uh, we will have two winners the first winner will be someone who will just be commenting here on the chat by putting in the correct answer and the second winner is someone who will join us on kahoot play and be the winner but here's the catch uh, I would want someone out of the 15 questions, at least you should we, uh, get at least 50% um, of them correct. That is around seven. You should have at least seven correct, and then you can be able to uh, win 1,000 KG Bob. We give it 1,000 KG Bob, and then we'll join. So I'm waiting for you guys to join. If you haven't, uh, you can go to kahoot.it, put in that code 8862219, or you can just copy uh, click the link that i've put in the chat so i'm waiting for people to join in so that we can be able to start off the game how many people are on here so if you're ready also in the chat i would want to know where are you joining us from and what is uh wh 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 where are you joining us from also put it there uh, i can see fathers asking what is the pin the pin is eight eight six two two one nine go to kahoot.it then put in that code or you can click the link in the chat that i put it and then we can be able to get started is that okay oh someone saying you are looking great thank you very much i appreciate that i can see someone else saying yes they are ready but no one is joining the uh, i want you to join the game on kahoot i will have 10 people there the winner gets their one thousand bob and if you are not in the Kahoot game, then you just comment, yeah? But be sure, the one people, uh, people when they're just commenting, you might be able just to win out of, uh, what do we call it? Um, it's just luck. But if you join the main game, there we go. Dr. Clinton from Moranga, I can see there is Bedwell all the way in Eldoret. I can see someone linked on linkedin saying they are from nairobi i can see there is kibet all the way in bomet oh great to have you i think 
Kibet, did you, or we were together with you in the morning when we were talking with the, the lady from uh, Impact Pool, right? Uh, okay, guys, ladies and gentlemen. No, okay, I can see people have already joined. Oh, so many people are already in. Uh, 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 uh. I had not recognized so many people are in. So are you ready to come? Can I press play and we get started? If you have not logged in, you have not joined through Kahoot, just put in your answer in the comments. Yeah, put in your answers in the comment and we are good to go. I think, yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Give us, okay, the pay the code. There we go. And let the game begin. I start the game now. 15 questions, very simple questions. If you're at home, if you're watching this as a replay, just put in the answer in the comments and you might be the winner. We will still have winners from the replay. Question number one, Career Point Solutions offer free CV review. True or false? Put in the answer, 20 seconds. Career Point Solutions offers free CV review. Is that true or is that false? If you're in the chat, if you're not joining the WhatsApp, uh, the group, just put yes, true or false. I can see Shana says true. I can see who else here. Sheikh saying true, or you want to say true. Okay. I can see who else here saying it is true. I can see someone Rena say uh, Rena, true. I can see someone is true, true, true. Okay. Let me see those who are playing with us. What did they have to say? And the answer is true. Seven of us got it correct and two of us got it wrong okay so let me see for those who have joined us right here who is leading we have k okay by the way i forgot to mention uh, i would want you to put in your real name if you can put your real name it will be better because when it comes to the prizes you will be able to get we will need to know your real name so that we can give you the prize so k we might have so many k's how do will i know it is you maybe we will get to talk i can see k is on top kibono uh nice uh nice soy you join us again last week you're here with us yeah yeah you are among the winners so let's look at simple question number two which is the fastest animal on land a is it the elephant is it cheetah is it ostrich or is it the lion put in your answer there if you have not joined the uh or kahoot has kicked you out remember we can only get 10 people the kahoot game yeah so put it in the chat i want to see the chat Oh, someone's still saying true. I can see Zunera say Zunera Naira saying uh, it's a cheetah. Okay, cheetah. I can see here cheetah. Is that correct? It might be the elephant. It might be. You never know. Yeah. Uh, okay. I will need to remove so that people can see. Um, okay. 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 So many people going for the uh, cheetah. So I need to remove this and look at the results who three people actually picked the elephant interesting seven people went for the cheetah that it was correct and six of you only went for all street okay no one picked the lion i get that huh so what how are the tables by the way if you're playing on kahoot the quicker you answer the higher the points that you get elizabeth takes the lead I have Kimondio still at number two. Naisoli at number three. We have, um, is it Sintonia and Jokes? Okay. Next question. By the way, if you're still with us, put that in the comment. Yeah, put it in the comment. We'll be able to see. Question number three. Which piece of information is not necessary in your CV? The keyword is not. Is it name, date of birth, email, or phone number? Which of this piece of information is not necessary, not necessary in your CV? Let me see here. Okay. Uh, okay, someone says I can't see the quiz. Please, um, there it is. I don't want first to put in the answers because I realize when I sh uh, show the answers, um, some of people who are putting it. Okay, someone says the phone number is not necessary. Interesting. Someone says date of birth is not important okay i can see someone else here going with phone number is not important i don't know and the correct answer is date of birth is not important yeah the date of birth is not important now let me say this it is a key piece of information in your cv but it is not important 
um, your name is very important, a necessary email address, phone number. That is how the quickest way to get in touch with you. So today, if you notice, I have put in some questions to do with the CV writing, cover letters, job application, because that is mainly what we do here at Career Point Solutions, and we help you get a job. So let's move on to question number. Um, okay, nice only getting three in a streak. Okay, nice so I can see you're doing good stuff. Now you are on top. Would you be the second uh, a winner on the second time on a roll? Let us find out. Question number four, which is the tallest animal on earth? Is it the giraffe? Is it the camel? Is it the horse or the snake? Put in your answer. The quicker you answer again, the quicker, uh, the more points you get. If you're there following us <coughs> on YouTube, LinkedIn or Facebook, put in the uh, answer as a comment. Just comment, comment, comment. We will pick someone at random to be our winner. I can see the answers are still coming in. The answers are coming in. So out of these four animals, which one? Okay, I can see someone there saying, let me pick some of the answers. Oh, they're moving so fast. Alice says giraffe. Felix talks about a giraffe. Julia talks about the giraffe. I can see uh, Joseph also talking about the giraffe. Is that correct? I don't know. And checking out the results. Six people said camel. Ha. All uh, the correct answer is the giraffe. Nine of us got it correct. I can tell you, you will find so many interesting answers here. So let's go to it and see how is it working for us right now. I can see a Syntonian getting four questions correct. That's the streak. You still get at number two. Naisoi uh, still leading this. This is great, yeah? Question number five. What is the largest ocean in the world? Is it Atlantic Ocean, Indian Ocean, Southern Oceans, or is it Pacific Ocean? General question here. If you know your stuff, you know. Yeah. Then, ten, 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 ten. If you are following us, YouTube, uh, Facebook, you are there on LinkedIn, put that in the chat. I can see some people saying Atlantic. Uh, other words, uh, Pacific, Atlantic. I can see. Okay, someone said the giraffe. Okay, Atlantic. Someone else goes with Atlantic. Someone else goes with Indian Ocean. Okay, I am not sure which one is this. Which is the greatest? Um, and the correct answer, looking here, is the Pacific Ocean. Pacific Ocean, not Atlantic, not Indian Ocean, or the Southern uh, Oceans. It is Pacific Ocean that is the greatest, uh, the biggest in terms of the area that it covers. And looking at, okay, nice soy, you are on a roll. I can see also um, up to four places. Money is the highest climber. You have gone up four steps. Yeah. Question number six. Caterpillars turn into butterflies. True or false? Do caterpillars turn into butterflies? True or false? Let me see your answers in the chat if you're following in the chat you might get a big uh winner okay still people talk about the giraffe i can see shake saying it is true i can see someone else who else is here saying it is true true or false caterpillars turn into butterflies okay this seemed to be a no-brainer uh okay i'm trying just to remove these they are coming so fast okay and the correct answer is true Six people think that is false. Interesting. Interesting. You don't know where butterflies come from. They were caterpillars at some point. And when we look at the tally, I can see up to four places. Frank has gone up up to four places. Naisoi still on the lead, followed by Sintonian. Okay. This seemed to be a good. Let's keep going. Number seven, we are halfway through this which country is called the land of the rising sun which country is referred to as the land of the rising sun is it kenya number one is it china japan or is it america you have 20, uh, 20 seconds drop in your answers there and to see how it's going here uh in the chat if you're following on youtube linkedin facebook you're not yet on kahoot 
drop that in the chat yeah put it in the comments put it in the comments and we will pick a winner from the comments i can see someone saying it is kenya another person saying it is japan another person saying that it is okay where are this china it is kenya it is kenya okay ah uh, good now let's look at the correct answer and the correct answer is japan japan is the land known as the land of the rising sun how we that is a question for another day and whoa whoa nice sorry jennifer you are still on the lead this is good this is good interesting question number eight which planet is known as the red planet is it mercury is it mars is it jupiter or is it earth which planet is known as the red planet drop that in the chat if you haven't joined us yet you just found us already running live drop that in the chat i can see someone uh, talking about is it mars i can see someone else liz joy talking about oh there's someone saying it's mercury someone else talks about it okay are you ready for the answer are you ready and the correct answer is mars mars is the planet known as the red planet not mercury one person picked mercury someone talked about the earth two of us i can see three people say jupiter oh how is the tally going kimondio you are back i can see hannah you are uh, one of our winners last week but today you are at number is it five okay nice soy still leading question number five Number nine. Oh, we are number nine. An adult has 34 teeth. True or false? An adult human being has 34 teeth. True or false? Okay. Drop that in the chat. Drop it in the chat. Drop it in the chat. The reason why we decided to go with Kahoot is because we are able to engage people who have already joined the game on Kahoot or that following us i can see someone saying it is true another person saying it is false okay let me try and check out false someone says it is true who is here okay another false another false another um, false so is it true or is it false and the correct answer is false an adult has 32 teeth a human adult has 32 teeth um maybe we'll ask for it a dog has more yeah who knows how much how many teeth a dog has i think it is 40 if i'm not wrong whoa whoa syntonian you have the highest answers streak nine of them in a row this is a very good race very good and interesting race the quicker you answer by the way on kahoot the more answers you get what services Actually, what services are offered by Career Point Solutions? I saw what service is offered by Career Point Solutions? Is this professional CV writing, interview coaching, online courses, or is it all of the above? Which service is offered by Career Point Solutions? Professional CV writing, interview coaching, online courses, or is it all of them? Yeah, yeah. All of them. You should read all the uh, answers first, yeah? Those who picked professional civil writing that is correct yes we do professional civil writing but we do all of these services yeah good 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 i can see the tally again i saw it has 10 correct answers in a row you are in a row actually we are question number 10 so you have everything correct so far now we are in the last leg five questions to go what is the gas that is most abundant in the atmosphere is it nitrogen is it oxygen is it carbon dioxide or is it neon which gas is most abundant in the atmosphere i want to give a chance also for those people who are following us online put in your answers there i can see someone saying uh, oxygen i can see someone saying all of the above you're still in the last question okay I can see someone saying all uh, nitrogen. Okay, someone says oxygen. That is uh, Victoria. I can see someone else talking about. Now they're moving too fast. I can't even nitrogen. I can see some. Was it oxygen? 
Okay, good. So the correct answer is the most abundant gas in the atmosphere is nitrogen. If you can remember your science, or is it chemistry or biology, but science, yeah? And I know it's not physics. It is nitrogen. Four more questions to go before we call it a day. Before we call it a day. Nice soy still on the lead. Greg has gone up all oh, three questions in a row. Greg at number three. I can see Sintonia there at number eight, two. Hannah, I can see you're really trying now. You're number four. Maybe you might end up in the top three. Let's go to the next question. True or false, the ostrich eye is bigger than its brain. True or false? Is it true that the ostrich eye is bigger than its brain? If you're following us live, drop that in the chat. Drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it in the chat. Drop it in the chat. I can see Zunera Sheikh saying it is true. I can see someone else uh, saying it is true. Uh, there is a false here. Uh, who is this someone saying false? Is it false? Okay. They're coming too quick. So far, you're saying it is true. Uh, someone else saying it is true. Okay. And the correct answer is true. Yes, the eye of the <laughs> ostrich, it's bigger than its brain. I don't know what it says about its thinking. Moving on. Okay, things have changed a little bit. Sintonia at the leading uh, position there, having gotten 12 correct questions in a row. And I saw you have a chance to reclaim. You have three more questions to go. What do you need to write a good application? What do you need to write a good job application? Is it the job description, a professional CV, cover letter, or all of the above? What do you need to write a good job application? Uh, job description, professional CV, uh, cover letter, or is it all of the above? Let me see some of the comments that are coming in here. Somebody talks about all of the above, a professional CV, Someone says false. I think this is the previous uh, question, yeah? And the correct answer, all of the above. Oh, we all got it correct, yeah? This time around, you read all the questions. And looking at the calculation, okay. Two more questions to go. Sintonian today being the leader, getting three, 13 questions in a row. Which is the continent with the most countries? Is it America? Is it Europe, Africa, or is it Asia? Which is the continent that has the highest number of countries? Uh, let me check my people who are following us live here. Which one do you think has the, uh, all of the above? Okay, that is the last job description. That was the last question. I can see someone say professional CV. That was the last question. Oh, someone is still at Japan. Okay, the, um, somebody talks about, is it Africa? I can see Xefa saying Asia. Who else is here? Um, all of the above. Is it Asia? Is it D? Okay. Um, I think they're coming too quick. The correct answer is Africa. Africa has the highest number of countries. That was a trick one, yeah? I can see people spread all over the place. Not sure. How the tables changed? I can see. Okay. Come on, you're got, uh, getting three in a row. This is the final question. The quicker you answer, the better for you. And there we go. True or false? Daniel Butuku YouTube channel has over 60,000 subscribers. That's my YouTube channel. By the way, if you're on YouTube, you got a link. Yeah, you got you you got the leakage. So is it true that my channel has more than 60 subscribers? True or false? True or false? Okay, I can see. Okay, they're really moving too fast. Very fast. Uh, some people say true. Someone says it is false. Someone says it's true. True, true. Okay, okay. Good, good, good. Uh, and the final, that was our final question. Okay, I'm trying to remove this. Okay, and the answer is true. Yeah, I just hit, I think today we got to 63 or 63,000. Yeah, 63,000 subscribers. 
thank you for subscribing to the channel and looking at the winner the table the winner for today's show it is gregory okay where did gregory come out of 11 okay that is number three nice so gets number two and the winner number one for today is Sintonian. a round of applause to Sintonian. i can see the runners up we have kimondio we have hannah and this is a job well done thank you very much ladies and gentlemen that has been our game show for today so very simple uh Sintonia, you can be able to get um okay let's replay and see who i mean, is at number three with six thousand and eighty three points we have gregory we have at number two nine uh nice soy and our winner is who yes Sintonian. thank you thank you a quick one here what i will do I need to copy. So what I will do for you to be able to get your prizes, this is the form that you need to fill in. It's a very simple form. Fill it in. I'll get to know uh, your details. And I'll need to pick one of the people who have just been commenting and getting. So give me a minute. I'll give you the details. Okay. Nice on, um, nice saw you. Don't worry. You get yourself a t-shirt or a notebook. And we also have the Gregory getting a t-shirt or a notebook. So the quickest way, what happens, you just need to send me your details yeah so allow me give me one minute go get back to our um, live broadcast i have put in a link in the form uh, a link in the form a form a link to a form a google form on the chat so i am looking forward to the following people to fill in um the three people who have just uh, won i'll get in touch with you tomorrow morning and we will have another winner let me just try to put this okay i will have another winner who has been commenting and that winner would be i have seen someone who has been very consistently posting posting okay i think there has been some problem with the network uh, okay there we go that is the form you can check it on linkedin or if you're here live uh, Facebook, uh, YouTube, please put in your details. And I want to pull in the winner who has I've seen they're getting correct answers throughout. okay i think this is uh, i don't know what this keeps on happening but i know how to fix it quick this time around there we go those are our winners fill in the form i'll just confirm that you got in we have centoria you get yourself kenya shillings 1000 we also have zonera shake you get yourself 1000 i've seen you consistently so fill in your name in the form i'll get in touch with you Gregory and Isaac. So all I need from that form is just your name, your name, your email address and phone number so that we can get in touch with you. Otherwise, ladies and gentlemen, this has been a great session. And this is what I tell you. Yeah. Uh, look at it. Uh, when I refresh, I already have seven people who have responded and I only had four winners. So I'm doubt I'm wondering where are the other four coming from? I might not be able to show you their names, but if it refreshes, you will actually see like seven responses. Okay, that is how we roll here in Kenya or wherever you are at. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been great. I really appreciate. I'll get in touch with the winners. Let me actually see if the winners have, uh, have gotten their details. And next week on Thursday, uh, on Tuesday, uh, Wednesday, we run another game show and we'll see who the winners are. Margaret, Grace, 
Okay, Jennifer, I've gotten your information. Gregory um, Mongela, I've gotten your information. Sylvia Sintonian, hopefully I pronounced it correct. I've gotten your information. The only person who at the currently is missing is um, Zuraid Sheikh. Fill in the form, I'll put it in the chat and we'll get in touch with you. So we have come to the end of this session. I want to know, did you have some fun? If you had some fun, say yes, you got some fun or just give me some interesting emojis that you have and then we'll, uh, I will appreciate. I can see Joseph saying, thank you. I really appreciate that. Okay, Vincent answering that other question. Okay, uh, let me not show your email address. I don't know. So did you have fun? If you had fun, show me in the chat. I can see, yes, Jockey saying you had fun. I really appreciate that. Um, I can see who else here. I just joined. Okay, too late. Join us early next time. Uh, are you enjoying this show? By the way, this is just a way to encourage you and to give you uh, a time to have fun. This is a way of releasing uh, stress, pressure. And the only thing you can do, I would really appreciate if you can head over to my YouTube channel, just search Daniel Mutuku and you can be able to subscribe to my channel it is very very simple so here i go if you go to youtube i don't know um yeah youtube okay today my internet is misbehaving just search daniel mutuku i think it's already there we go um Okay, for some reason today, the internet is so slow. But anyway, thank you very much. Go to YouTube, Daniel Mutuku, subscribe to my channel. And I'm looking forward to be giving you more and more valuable content as we continue. Otherwise, okay, oh, some comments here. Let me read them so that I can appreciate you too. Uh, someone, thank you so much for uh, the sad. This has been a great program. Uh, Tevin come, came in late but enjoyed uh, the last bit. That is still okay. No, it wasn't fun. I didn't know the method you were using to choose the winners. Okay, if you joined in the Kahoot, you uh, would be a winner automatically. But for those who are just commenting, I would pick the person I have found um, more consistent or getting the answers correct. How do you get to Kahoot? You just go to kahoot.it. But I'll share, I usually share the link as we start. Okay, there we go. We have amazing water still answering the question about Pacific. I appreciate that. And I can see I have just joined. Okay, I think that is it. I really appreciate until next week. We meet here. We have two more rounds and then the winner will be able to get our Badass Pro Coaching Program 100% free. That program is worth the, um, the, the 25000 that I normally talk about. Yeah. So if you are interested in that, keep watching. And by the way, subscribe to my YouTube channel, leave a comment. And until next time, I'll...